He was on his way to his appointment and I told him <laughs> a children's hospital has plenty of money. UC Westchester has plenty. They were bragging. They got 1.2 billion in assets. They got umbrella insurance policies. Dr. Durrani has plenty of insurance. I just want to let you know you deserve every day. And I don't want him leaving this country. That's well, he's not going to leave now. <laughs> By the way, do you believe they let him leave a couple months ago? I was like, ah! <laughs> we all were sleeping with all this. Let me put this in context. You know, I fought the Kentucky Bar Association, and I, and I still do, and it doesn't bother me because I know I'm okay. I'm, I don't do anything to get this far. It's all BS, man. They just hate me. But you know what? I thought about this. If I had a hundred... I'd say, screw this, I'm going to Mexico. I mean, I, he's got to be delusional, delusional, to just say, no big deal, I'm going to keep operating on people. I mean, his comment, the comment they said he made... Of and he said, well, when did he become a bad surgeon? Only after Dieter sued him 67 times? So they're fighting amongst themselves. The defendants are fighting amongst themselves. And I find out Mike Lyon acted like I knew, and I didn't know. Mike Lyon revealed that you see and Children's received criminal subpoenas to the federal grand jury. Good. And he, but I didn't. I played it cool. But he dropped all pretenses. He finally dropped all pretenses. You know. You know, he, we're all more. How do you tell your kids that? But of all things, he had no compassion whatsoever when he touched those children and did what he did to them. He defiled the Holy Spirit Peter. How do you do that to a child and know that you're doing that to a child? Jacob Feltner has cancer risk in his family, and he put that BMP3 on any without you telling his parents or anything else. It's incredible. Thank you all so much. Thank you. Thank you.